Eso, self-love example numero cuatro. <laughs> Hello, you beautiful soul. My name is Nat, and on my channel, I help you out in your self-love journey. That's why I'm so excited for today's video. I'll be sharing with you five self-love examples that will inspire you. And this is overall great for your self-love journey and your self-improvement. And why will these examples inspire you today? Well, I feel like a lot of times when we think about self-love, we focus a lot on the self-care aspect as in treating ourselves and pampering ourselves. But today I'm going to go deeper into self-love. So let's get into it. Okay, self-love numero uno, self-love example one I have for you is to cut off toxic relationships, whether that's with your significant other, a friendship, or even a family member. And it would be so beneficial for you to be able to get away from this relationship. That way you don't have their influence or their opinion, especially if it's someone that just really brings you down or when you're around them, their energy just really drains you. And I know in some cases, especially if it's a family member, it's hard to just cut off that relationship or even if it's a significant other you've been with a long time. But even giving yourself a break from them and giving your time, giving your time apart from each other and seeing how that benefits you or if it does benefit you and you get to see yourself without that relationship and this way it will really help you out to just becoming a better you if that person in your life is not giving any good to your life and is only bringing bad to your life it will definitely help you out to not have them give that break away so you can focus on you and just again becoming a better you because they are not in your life and I know it's going to be tough, but trust and believe if it's meant to be, it will be. And if it's not, then you're only going to be giving yourself such a better life that you deserve. But all right, on to the second self-love example. So, a numero dos self-love example. The second one is to forgive those who have damaged you giving you heartbreak, misled you, have broken your trust, forgive them inside for you're not doing this for them, not at all. You're forgiving those who have hurt you in the past. You're solely doing this for yourself. That way you are able to move forward. That way you can be more present in the now and be more better for the future because most likely if you haven't forgiven someone who has hurt you in the past you're living in the past and you're not able to move forward so again you aren't doing this for them you are doing this for yourself in order to be a better you and someone who can move forward and look leave the past behind you or vice versa if you know that you have hurt somebody and you know that you need to apologize then go ahead and reach out to that person even if you don't communicate anymore and let them know that how sorry you are and how you know that you did wrong and that way you will feel so much better and they will feel better and you could just bring love and peace more to the world just by doing that and actually before i get into the next example i just wanted to quickly say many of you might know some of you might not know but october is breast cancer awareness month and in order to support the cause a lot of people just wear pink to show that they support the cause so that is why i'm wearing pink today and if you yourself support the cause, then just comment down below. On October, we wear pink. Thank you for listening. Already on to the third example. Example numero tres, self-love example three for you is to believe in your dreams and goals, especially when no one else does. A lot of the times we can share our dreams and visions with those who are close to us and they don't always support that. 
And a lot of times they don't support that is because they don't see it. They don't envision it the way you are envisioning it because they're not in your mind. They can't see what you're imagining or dreaming of. So it is so important, especially when no one else is there supporting what you are dreaming of to be your own person who supports your dreams and goals. So really be kind to yourself with this. See yourself as your best friend in this. If you had a best friend that they shared something that they want to accomplish and do, you would give them that support. Do that for yourself. You need to be your own best friend in this because it's so important to follow your dreams and your goals and to really go after them. Because again, not everybody is going to see the vision. And when no one else does see it, that's when you have to step up and believe in yourself because you can do it. I'm letting you know whatever you dream or believe in and if you work hard for it, you definitely can accomplish it. But you really have to believe in yourself. Don't let others put you down and letting you tell you that you can't do it because you can do it. Again though, you have to do it yourself and you have to believe that you can and you will. But mm -mm -mm, on to example four. All right, so self-love example numero cuatro, self-love number four for you is to learn to say no. It is so easy for us to fall into the phase of being a people pleaser. It happens to the best of us, but it is so crucial to learn to say no to things you don't want to do, to even people you don't want to talk to at the time. Just say no. Learn to say no to anything and everything that you don't want to do, especially if you don't feel comfortable doing it. Because most of the times we overthink it and we think, oh, if I say no, then we make, we play out a whole scenario that might not even happen at all. So get comfortable saying no and you will realize that life goes on. You will say no to whatever it is that you say no to and it's gonna be okay. Life will go on and you will get better at practicing saying no and you're gonna feel so much better because you won't have to feel like you always need to be there for somebody or say yes to everything, to everybody or anything that somebody or people want you to do. Because at the end of the day, look out for yourself if you don't want to do it then simply say no. I promise you, life goes on. But all right, on to the fifth self-love example. All righty, self-love example numero cinco, number five for you is to learn to love your self-expression. What do I mean by that? Is to learn to love your true, unique personality. So when it comes to fashion, makeup, hairstyle, even your hobbies that you do or how you decorate your space, like learn to do it in the way that makes your heart happy. Don't get into the habit of wanting to only do what's trending or what's cool. If that's not making you truly happy, then do whatever it is that makes you truly happy even if it's not the norm especially when it's not the norm because if we lived in a society that everybody was the same how boring would that be we need your beautiful unique different personality to shine through whatever and however that is and especially for yourself you deserve it you deserve to really truly find out what you love and what you like and express it through the world again it doesn't have to be like how everybody else is or what everybody else is doing and that's what makes it more special so go out there explore express yourself to the fullest be creative and be beautifully uniquely you and since we're the topic of self-love, I did make a video on 23 things to love about yourself. So I would encourage you to go ahead and click on that video. It'll be right up here for you. But already, thank you so much for tuning in. If these, any of these five self-love examples truly inspired you, then I would really appreciate you buying me a coffee, simply sending me a thank you tip. The description is down below. That just helps me to know that you found my content valuable. But 
if you did like this video then of course like the video <laughs> and comment down below letting me know hey girl you truly inspired me today okay i would love to know and of course if you want to see more of this face then subscribe to your girl because i would truly appreciate it and i want to leave off by saying be kind to others but most importantly be kind to yourself now go let yourself shine